What's up, guys? Journal Santucci. I'm showing you a replay uh, of a battle I won. Uh, you can see by the uh, Om Egypt um, and the other guys, Pontus, of course. And I just want to show you, see what they got here. Um, it's a nice little look. Uh, the Battle of the Pyramids. I like those, uh, those like crocodile head dudes. They're pretty cool looking. Uh, yeah, we're just uh, we were actually really close, I think, in this battle. We'll just check, take it out, to take a look. See, he used archers. You can tell uh, that's I have an advantage in range. Um, we're off the bat, so that's gonna be fun. I have encourage ability with the uh, crocodile dude and my general. All right, let's pause this. All right, let's take a look. I'll show you how I set up my dudes before we actually go at it. All right, I have uh, Egyptian slingers and Rhodian Rhodian sling slingers. You can see I have uh, five, and then I have skirmisher cav in the back. So I got my pikemen, two of them here, and an Egyptian pikemen, which is really cheap, but uh, they're pretty good. Uh, my general, let's see, this is a this is a crocodile dudes. I got the camera mod on, so let me give you a nice little good shot here. There you go. How about that? Bam. These guys look beast mode. Um, damn, they killed the crocodile and they practically skinned it and put its whole body around them. It's pretty awesome. I cut the bottom bottom of them off. Uh, this is my uh, gen general right here. They are just ridiculous. Uh, they cut through. They can cut through pretty much anything. A citizen cav, which is not really a, uh, a big time cav unit, which I have two of them and two skirmishers. Now let's take a look at how he set his army up. Uh, let's see. He's got uh, Leffy Pikes. Really, really spread out, two of them, and he's got uh, hoplites on each flank. Then he's got uh, he's flanked by uh, Pontic swordsmen, two of them. His general is a Pontic royal guard. Now he has his eastern archers here, and then his citizen cav on the flank. Two of them on that side and one on this side here. So let's take a look. And I have chosen this place. Now, I knew off the bat my uh, men um, were better in, uh, we're pretty much, Cav, or with the Cav, we're pretty much equal. Uh, with his Ponte Cav, is pretty tough, but my art, my missiles are pretty uh, pretty good. Riders at the double. Quickly now. Let's give you some close-ups. This would be a good Sounds of Glory. I'm sorry I haven't been getting those out lately. Uh, I've been working on uh, a lot of other things. It's been crazy. And let's see. Oh, yeah, I'm on Twitter, by the way. Guys, you got to add me on Twitter. Um, at General Santucci. Uh, capital G, capital S. Uh, isn't that cool? They're actually doing that, making them uh, cheer. So I'm bringing up my cab over here. My, uh, I think these are my skirmishers. guys aren't in phalanx. I don't know why. Let's take a look. I don't know what that was. I want to see if I can match his uh, cab over here. If you guys are wondering my um, specs for my computer, because I know uh, I don't know actually if you see that many uh, games looking like this, but uh, I'll tell you at the end. I could take these guys down without the archers even touching me. So he looks, he goes for that. He tries to go for my archers, but I charge him with my citizens. And then I'm going to flank him with this and blast him in the back. Look. 
Oh, that's brutal. It's already down by like 15 guys. He's killing those own guys. Oh, wow. But this unit here will totally tear me up. So, I need to worry about uh, my cav too. But you can see, look how far I can shoot. Oh. Now it sucks that this unit here is starting to route. But uh, what can you do? There's a hoplite over there I'm trying to get away from him. Oh, wow. Let's see what's going on with that hoplite unit. I think I was pegging the shit out of him. Thought I was. This is just a big shit fest over here. I mean, I did take him down quite a bit. But uh, what you want to do um, when you're in a situation, you know, it depends if you can think while this is happening. You want to bring back your, your men. Bring them back farther so you can uh, actually make these guys come up. Wow. I don't know if I was actually... Um, Oh, look, this guy came back from Radin. Okay, look. Look at this cav unit. He's actually going to charge in at me. So I bring up my general. Oh, that guy's done. This, this unit right here is beast. Oh. This is my flank, fool. All right, he's charging in my archers, but look at this. The citizen cab just got totally drenched with death. So I got to chase him out of here. And I'm starting to I almost ran into his hoplites. So I, I got to get my guys into position. And look at all these dead archers. So that means I gotta go bring my men over. Understood. These uh, hoplites are no match for these Royal Thorax. The generals in this unit, and these guys are some serious swordsmen. But uh, let's check out what's going on around here. He's starting to flank with this uh, swordsman over here. So I gotta turn my flank because these uh, pikemen are gonna get trounced. Now he's coming in with his cav. I gotta see if I can uh, hold these guys back at least. Um, I'm not gonna run with these units here because that would definitely be a rout. So you can see over here, uh, I totally annihilated that one unit. And I'm just going after his uh, archers. So that's that was good. I need to get rid of them. Honestly, I don't know what number this is for battle. So um, I could be wrong. Look at this, this, uh, all these uh, crocodile guys are getting annihilated. Yeah, that's real nice. Just route. Look at that. Now you gotta surround their asses. Look at this. I'm starting to do a complete surround on these guys. <coughs> this is really close. Where's my general, actually? Oh, he's over here. Oh, yeah. You don't want to mess with him. Oh, yeah, these guys are done. So I guess I have to form a battle line. Uh, that unit looks like he's coming back. And I got more cav. I got cav everywhere. Oh, they, I forgot about that one because I'm an idiot. See how I'm moving them around. Oh, that sucked. 
see how they're coming in. No, I'm coming in with this unit. I'm trying to chase this guy away so I can reform my line. Now that he could have charged this unit. So I'm trying to um, match his uh, his moves. At least slow them down. Oh yeah, look at that Pontic Swordsman. They're so dead. My general's gonna have to just tear these guys up. I got everybody over here. Oh no, I don't. Oh, this unit's getting annihilated. Oh, it says he's winning. That one's definitely not. I'm actually trying to do a complete surround on them. But you can see these guys are coming up my flank. Be nice if they got into their phalanx. You can see how they did not listen. I told them to attack. Oh, yeah, that unit's dead. Look at that. Understood. Wait on my order. I so I'm destroying that uh, general over there, but my guys are starting to route, so I need to um, get rid of that general. And I figured, all right, I, I'm going to lose these two, so I better pull them close to my general unit. And I was pursuing the uh, attack big time. I did not want to let up on them. Now their general is dead or routing. Now I can get a nice uh, phalanx attack on these guys. Now look at that. Now my guy stopped routing. Oh, this is just sheer death. Look, I'm gonna keep that going. Pontic Swordsman's going down. Hoplite taking down my pikeman. But once I send him in there. Now I'm coming around the flank, you see. Let me see if they're ratting. They're getting owned. They're trying to run through my ranks. I can't be good. Oh, my pikeman ratted. Oh, boy. So that, yeah, that was a tough victory. Um, those uh, royals, man. They're <laughs> Let's take a look at them. My royal, my general, the royal. Um, uh, what are they called? Royal uh, thorax swordsman. Look at all those kills, 352, and they got three experience upgrades. Pretty impressive. And a, a skirmisher calf got 145 kills. Uh, that was pretty cool. Look at my slingers. It's just totally ruled the battlefield. These. Coltless guys, they they suck. They really can't kill anything. Um, probably because they're outnumbered from the bat. What, well, yeah, 80? And a couple pike kills, not too much. Uh, this Egyptian one did a little bit better than I thought I was going to do. But look at his general. Almost had the same amount of kills as mine. Probably could charge a lot of my uh, slingers and stuff, but still, like, these Pontic Swordsmen were pretty decent. These Hoplites got no, no kill. Oh, he's a, le a Levy Pikeman, yeah. But uh, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed that battle. Um, my uh, specs are, let's see, a 3 gig gigabyte um, Asus graphics card, DDR5 RAM. forgot how much is in there. Um, yeah, 3 gigabyte of, yeah, DDR3, DDR5. Uh, it's Asus. It's uh, like a GeForce. And then on top of that, um, I have uh, 8, gig 8 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM. Um so that's eight gigabytes. I have uh, a six-core AMD processor, Turbo. 
uh, my motherboard. I'm not 100% sure what it is, but it can uh, house up to 32 gigabytes of RAM. Um, it's got USB, uh, the fastest USB you can get right now built into it. Um, I got a Sound Blaster uh, Fatality, and it's got the um, optical out and all that crazy shit, both uh, front and back. Uh, yeah, HDMI and all that stuff. Uh, if you guys want to know that, uh, don't forget, Twitter me. Uh, at General Santucci, capital G for the general, capital S for the Santucci, and yeah, uh, ask me questions. Once I get enough people, I'll start tweeting, and I'll see you. Thanks for watching.